Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please hit that subscribe and notification button. Today I did a look with the Huda Beauty Ruby Obsessions palette and I am in love. So if you want to see how I got this look, please keep watching. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. We are continuing on with the theme of no foundation. And I've been picking at my skin a little bit. I might have to do a little touch up with some powder, but but yeah, so we're gonna see how this goes. So today we're gonna look do a look with the Huda Beauty Ruby Obsessions palette. I it came today actually and one of the shadows was cracked, this one, but I just pressed it down in there because I don't want to, I don't want to wait for it again. I'm so spoiled. So we're going to pop this on our face and see what we think. I've heard nothing but fabulous things about these palettes. I bought that and I bought, of course, the Emerald Obsessions palette because not only is green one of my favorite colors, but Emerald is my burst in. So, yeah, so we've took off the eye makeup from before. We're just going to touch up our face a little bit, and then we're going to go right into this. So, let's start off with putting some primer on our eyelids and try and use up this Lorac stuff this week before... Before we end our pan that project, whatever. I have no idea what's on my hands. None. None. It's all right. It's going to be okay, Susan. Don't worry about it. Okay. So, I only got the two. I don't think the blue was too close to... Um, I think it's a hard candy palette I have. I'll have to double check. But it, it was so close to that that I was like, eh, I'm not sure about this. All right, we're just gonna set this down with some of our Urban Decay. Our lids are already a little pink from the ColourPop palette. I think it's gonna stay in my eyes, but that's okay. It was beautiful, it was beautiful. Now we're going to put a little bit under our eyes again. With one of our brushes, I'm going to use this old MAC powder brush. Just kind of set some stuff down. What do you have in your hair? Just ignore me. All right, so I really want to go with a very dark red, um, you know, bam in your face kind of thing. So I think I'm going to focus on like this red, this red, that shimmer. We'll see how this goes along. And I'm going to put this up into my transition. So we're going to start there. And we'll put our brush in here. And we'll start packing that. Or blending that up into our transition. It's a very pretty color. It's like a, it's like a rose colored red. I'm sure it has a name to it that I cannot see. I'm going to order glasses tomorrow, I think. Because I, I just can't. I, I just can't keep up with it. Those glasses that I have are like two prescriptions ago because I broke my glasses. Yes, I did. I broke them. I didn't mean to. Okay, so now I'm going to go into this red right here. And we'll put that into our crease. Oh, he's so pigmented. <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
Well, excuse me, red. Maybe I'm going to go into that red and put that all over my eyes. I don't know. I need to see what it looks like. It is red. <sighs> Let's just see, Susan. Let's just see. It's makeup. You can take it off. Let's see how getting it with a brush does. I may need to wet my brush, although I heard you don't have to wet your brush with this palette. trying another shimmer and there I was just thinking outside the box a little bit. It did not like it. it. Doesn't like it me thinking outside the box. It doesn't want to do anything different. Whoops. I must knock my drink over. That would have not been pretty. Alright, so I'm gonna try a different brush. I think that brush is probably just a little bit too stiff to do what I want it to do. So we're just blending this red shimmer onto our eye. I'm sure if you wet this, it would be much more intense, but I think I'm pretty okay with how it looks. I don't think I want to wet it. I don't think I want to wet it. Okay. All right, that's pretty darn red for us. Now we're gonna go into this like burgundy shade right here and we're gonna put that in our outer V. That is pretty darn burgundy. Blend it up. Don't want any harsh lines in this. This is fabulous. It's absolutely gorgeous. I'm in love. Like when I started, before I started YouTube, when I got back into collecting makeup, because YouTube made me do it, um, I didn't think I was like totally against oranges, yellows, reds, and now I can't get away from them. I love them. Even pinks. I would have never thought I would have touched a pink with a 10 foot pole. But I love it. I love it now. I need to pack some more. Alright. I wasn't going to wet my brush, but now I think I am. We're just going to try it and see what it does. See how much more intense it makes the shadow. Ooh, that's much more intense. I have to take a break from filming because I'm feeling a little under the weather. All right, I'm gonna go into this corner shade right here and I'm going to use that on my inner corner. Going to the corner for my inner corner. Oh, that's pretty. It might probably be pretty all over the eyes. Yeah. Too bad this was the shade that was crumbled in the or should I say cracked? Not crumbled, cracked. In the palette. Okay, guys, let's put on some mascara. I really like that. I'm gonna probably change my lip out. 
as well. We'll put something red on. Red. When I got this, or when I ordered it, I went to get it in the store and they didn't have any more. But um, when I ordered it, or when I saw it in the store, the, they had the tester, of course. It was like, oh, this is going to be a fabulous holiday palette. Fabulous. Once again, still no foundation on. Just a powder, loose powder at that. And um, some bronzer and stuff. You are beautiful, you are kind, you are smart. All right, I do not know what this is. It came in one of my my um, boxes, but it's a really red, red. I look a little devilish. All right, everybody. This is my look with the Huda Beauty Ruby Obsessions palette. Um, I think it's absolutely beautiful. Red, red, red. All right, you guys. I love you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Mwah.